Hello ladies and gentlemen, Panzer here, and uh, this is going to be something of a little bit of a different video today. So, I was looking at the uh, subreddit for Elite Dangerous, and I came across this uh, tutorial for how to change your HUD colors in the game. And now there isn't a way to do this through the options or anything like that yet, or at all. So you have to actually change it through some of the configuration files. So first thing first, you want to to find a file called graphics configuration. Now it's a .xml file and it's located at the installation directory. This is uh, a directory that's... I'm gonna put the directory name on the on the screen right now as an annotation so it's there in front of you. There is an alternative location that it could be at if you can't find it in the installation directory, but it should be at either one. So look for this graphicsconfiguration.xml. And once you've found that, you need to find a section called GUI Color. Now you can just do that by hitting Control F on your keyboard. This is a file that's opened in Notepad, by the way. So you open that in Notepad and then you find the section called GUI Color. And then you should see a, a section that says localization name with the, the word standard in between. And there's the area that you want to actually uh, do your editing. So that's, uh, there's three different values that you can change uh, under three different sections. So these sections matrix red, matrix green, and matrix blue are the ones you want to change. Now you don't want to change any of the others because as far as I can tell, those don't seem to affect anything. The one that actually makes the colors change is located in this section here that I'm showing you on the screen right now. So the default values kind of look like this. Now they might defer a little bit because I have changed mine, but that's the basic idea. There's three different values and these seem to be RGB values or red, green, blue, but they don't go up to 255 as some people might be used to. These go only up to one or to negative one. So the numbers here have two minimum and maximum values and you can change it to any increment that you want in between. Now you can manually change these if you want to experiment with it, but there is a site and it's made by uh, somebody called Arku and it's called a HUD color theme editor. I'll put the link in the description below and there's a bunch of sliders there and you can change it and actually see the effects on screen and then it'll give you the output values at the bottom. So those are the numbers that you can use to have that particular color set up. So once you've done that, by the way, all the, dis the the description will contain the links to the original subreddit post as well, so you can actually see the uh, directions down there as well. Okay, so uh, as you saw in the montage in the intro, there's a bunch of different colors that I have tried out, and they all seem to have varying different effects. For example, the black one doesn't seem to work so well, but white kind of looks okay. So experiment with those and get something that you want. Now they don't change the orbit lines or any of those things, but they do change your HUD colors and all of the menus. So if you were, uh, with the exception of the main menu, if you go into a station, for example, you are going to see the menu there change as well. Uh, and you're going to see all the menus in your ship change as well. So pick something that you are going to be able to get used to because you're going to see it everywhere. And uh, that's really about it. I'm going to now go through, just uh, show you a montage of all of the different colors that I've tried out. And I will be putting the values on screen for you to try out for yourself. So feel free to pause it if you see something you like. And you can copy the values straight out of that into the notepad uh, that you are using. And that's really it. So uh, enjoy, and thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. 